Well, hello and welcome to Outdoors for Adventure. Today we are going to do a video on this Cool Pal magnetic car phone mount. Now in the past I've always used the mounts that clamp around your phone and they can be a pain when you're trying to take your phone off and, and stuff like that. So they started putting magnets in the back of the cases like the iPhones. So we upgraded our phones and I went ahead and got a uh, Armadillo Tech case that actually has the metal in the back of it, which also works as a kickstand. And we have a video about this case on our channel. I'll put a link to that in the description if you wanna go check that out. Uh, a plus on the case, I really like it. But uh, since it has that built in, you can use these mag, mag safe mounts. And as you can see, it holds it good. The reason that's wobbling is because this is kickstand. So I do have one of these mounted in my Grand Cherokee. And so far I haven't uh, lost the phone. It hasn't bounced off. We have been down some rough roads. It's got a good hold. And, but with that being a kickstand, you do have some looseness there. But so far it hasn't created an issue for me. And when you pull it off, just pull it from the bottom and it'll come right off. But yeah, it's a pretty good system. I really like it. And uh, these phones that we have are the newest phones and they're pretty heavy. But this has very sticky suction cup on it. Uh, it does have the stickiness to the cup itself. So once you get it on there, it's there pretty good. It's not easy to get off. So be sure when you mount it, you've got everything lined up where you want it to be and stick it on there, you'll push, and then you'll clip it with that little handle right there, and that'll draw it tight, and that ain't moving. I'll put a picture of how I have mine mounted. Uh, I don't want anything stuck to the dash of my Grand Cherokee uh, because I'm not sure that the material that that dash is made out of wouldn't pull loose. It may not be an issue, now I'm gonna stick nothing to my dash. So this goes to the window. I've got it on my left door side and I have a perfect spot for my phone to mount there. And it hangs down just a little bit to where the air conditioner vent's blowing on it. So that's keeping it cool. And you can rotate these to where you can, could, once you get it positioned like you want it, you could actually record with it. Let's see how far I can bend this down. I can go down that far there. And then I can raise it, depending on the angle of the window, if I need it to be like this with the camera below, you know, you'd have to play with it to get it right. But you should be able to record as a dash cam with this mount because there's nothing that I can see. Let's put it on camera. Yeah, you might have to adjust it because I do see the mount. Let's see here. It all depends on how you're using it. If you're using the windshield mount, this can get in the way. I guess if you have it on the dash, of course, I don't know if it'll bend down enough. So if you have it on your dash like this, you could definitely, yeah, you can definitely record with it. So I may have to come up with another option to mount it to where I can mount it on dash because that would be cool to use this to record going down the road when you need to. So uh, I'll check into that. Maybe if I put a big enough base plate on the dash and then stick this to it, I won't have to worry about that because I really like the idea of recording with this like that. Okay, but anyway, uh, some people that may not even be an issue, but you have adjustment there 
with a wing nut. You also have a wing nut here with adjustment where this can go down, just like about two inches of adjustment in and out. And once it's tight, it's solid. You have a, you can tighten and loosen this here. It also, the kit comes with this base here with 3M on the back to where if you don't have a case that has this built into it, you can stick that to the back of your case and it'll do the same thing that this ring does. It just won't be a kickstand, it'll be just permanent. Uh, so that's an option. The kit also comes with a vent mount. If you would like to use this vent mount, you would pop this off this ball and then you will pop this ball in there, tighten this up and you can hook this on your mount and you'd have a vent mount. Uh, I don't use vent mounts myself, but if you want to, I can get that off there. It is an option. So you have the vent mount there. Okay, like I said, it also, put that up like this. Let's just move my phone out of the way. So you have the vent mount, the windshield dash mount, or whatever it'll stick to mount. Very nice. And then you have the base plate if you need to make your case to where it will stick to this. Very strong. It comes with your wet wipes and cleaning cloths. For preparation, especially if you want to stick this to your case, you can clean it up, get it ready for that mount to be added to it. It does come with a complete set of instructions in color, and they're they're good instructions. Let's turn that around this way. Let's see here. There is a welcome guide. Oh, this is something else I'm gonna show y'all. This kit also comes with measuring kits. So you can lay it on the back of your phone and get your uh, yeah, I've got two of them, but you can get your uh, plate mounted exactly where it needs to be because it needs to be in a certain area on the back of your phone for uh, if you're using it for wireless charging. And I do have a battery pack system that I'm going to show you in the next video that will kind of go along with all this. It, it, your phone will just lay on it and take a charge, wireless charging and it'll stick to your, your phone really well. But uh, let's see what we have on this website about this mount, and maybe it'll give you more, uh, more clarification about it. Window magnet phone holder for a car max safe suction mount, 360 degree rotation, dashboard car phone holder mount, uh, let's see what else we what else we have here. Works with all the iPhones, and as long as your case has the magnet on the back of it, whether it's built into it like Armadillo Tech puts in theirs, or if you put one on there yourself, it will work with those phones.
It is a two-in-one MagSafe car mount, flexible vent base or suction cup base, means you can find the most stable, suitable, and convenient base for any car model. The most cost-effective and convenient option. Each insulation model is the best design on the market. It's 20 times N55 magnets. Everything will just click to it. One hand operation, fence 99% air vents, horizontal, vertical, or round. Super powerful suction cup loading up to 80 pounds. It is designed for mag safe, such as a case with the metal ring or a MagSafe case, or 14, 13, 12 series without the case. Let's see, a powerful magnetic phone holder can create a powerful attraction that firmly supports your device while allowing you to drive without distraction. It easily and securely holds your phone through bumps, sharp turns, and even sudden stops. No worrying about dropping your phone. The ball joint arm of the mobile phone car mount are 10 times sturdier than normal ones, so just 270 degrees, telescopic arm, 360 rotation ball joint, extendable arm, allows you to rotate your phone to landscape or portrait and adjust your phone to a position angle that meets your needs. During driving, you can adjust this car cell phone holder according to the front passenger seat to avoid obstructing the sight and assuring driving stability and safety. There's really not anything else I think I need to say about the case. I think I covered most everything that there is. Now, this was not given to me. This was something I purchased myself. And uh, I even thought about gluing this to the back of a tablet so I can just use that to hold my tablet too. Uh, I haven't made that decision complete yet. But it does have many uses. I even thought about putting my switch panel that I just installed in the Grand Cherokee, mounting that to the back of the switch panel, and then just putting my switch panel on that and sticking it just wherever I wanted. But I decided against that and mounted it solid onto the side of my console. But uh, there's many uses you could use these for. And the magnets that they give you, to, if you want to put it on a case, they are really strong. So if you're looking for a case, be sure to check out this Cool Power, or Cool Pal magnetic car phone mount. Especially right now for 10 bucks, you can't go wrong with that. And normal price is $15. So uh, yeah, it's a really nice heavy duty case. And uh, I stuck this to my windshield. I didn't have it exactly where I wanted it. And let me tell you, it's a booger barrier pulling this back off. And you may think you don't want that, but you do because that means it's gonna stay stuck up there and it's not gonna be falling off with the weight of your phone. And I'm telling you, these new phones just keep getting heavier and heavier. This one weighs quite a bit. So if you're looking for a good mount, I recommend this one. I'm going to be using them for a while, so stay in touch on the channel, and I'll give updates how it's holding up, and you'll probably see me using it, and I uh, appreciate y'all stopping by to watch. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and help us grow. Appreciate it. Y'all have a good day.